welcome back to Grimes Finds for another unboxing. This unit right here, I have no footage from because I actually bought this probably like three or four months ago. And when we first moved into this new building, we just threw the stuff in a 40, uh, 40 foot container that we have out back. And so we just got to this stuff. And so, but it's saying stuff like antique glass, fragile, it's all French stuff here. So anyway, let's, let's cut to the chase. No more chit chat and let's see what we got. If everybody else wants to say hi, uh, David, Leo, Jacob, my beautiful wife, Gina. So anyway, so you'll notice, like I've been trying to, one of the problems we have around here is these guys don't like to change clothes. They wear the same thing to work every day. If you notice, like a week ago in our last video, these guys were wearing the exact same thing. And obviously I went home and took a shower and uh, changed clothes. So y'all just leave a comment down below because, you know, smell of vision is probably right around the corner. We don't want to deal with that. Anyway. All right. Let's see what we got. Antique glass. This could mean so many things. So many things. Let's see what we got. And so let's just do a little educational video. So antique, right? Um, we learned in, in Auctioneer Academy that antique, uh, it means 100 years or more. So you'll see some people have stuff from the 60s, 70s, 80s, and they're calling it antique. And you know, this is what I ask these guys is 100 years old. Vintage, you know, is more a loose definition, but anyway. Uh, so, big chip in the first one. Uh, this is a lot of little stuff. Hey, I tell you what, let's fast forward this video. Hey, will you guys cut these boxes? Just slip these boxes? And you kind of, I mean, look at these. Show them these boxes. These are sealed. So if we find, you know, gold bricks in there, so you will be here to witness it firsthand. So this is kind of cool. Look, uh, it's a peacock. Looks like some kind of peacock, but it's a wine stopper. So that's kind of neat, you know. Uh, and if that's true antique glass, it could, we don't know what it's for. Uh, let's see. Let's tear some of these open. Hey, I tell you what, you guys want to start grabbing some of these and I'm wrapping them off to the side. That'd be great. I'll speed it up. Okay, so I'm liking what I'm seeing. I thought that was going to be like McCoy or uh, some kind of earlier U.S. pottery, uh, but this looks kind of cheap on bottom. There's no markers on there, but I don't know. I told you pottery is not my strong suit, um, but that does look like a McCoy style. Uh, I like going to the bottom. I like the good stuff on the bottom. Let's see. If we can find a bunch of sterling silver, that'd be nice. Okay, well, what is this? Uh, this might be... Waterford, it's a, does Waterford is, has the star pattern? Oh, that sucks. A little chalk statue that broke. That sucks. Okay, well, I'm liking these boxes so far. There's a lot of good syllables in here, it looks like. Uh, so, let's go ahead and watch that um, on a shelf. It'll go by itself. Uh, so, we are still, that's older pottery, but look at that. That's, that's upsetting. That would have been nice. So, and I just, that's too broke to sell. So, anyway, let's keep going. We might find some early pottery in here. Okay, so, okay, we got here. Looks like probably Avon. It is old Avon. It's a flamingo. Is that what it is? Mm hmm. Or a um, flamingo decanter. Yeah, what's up, buddy? Did you work this all Yeah, old keys they sell. Okay, um, where are So, what are you Oh, here we go. What's in here? That's cool. Okay, so I do know about butterflies because I bought some. I bought a collection on Facebook. And taxidermy, I don't know if that's the correct term. Actually, I know there's a different word for it. But this kind of stuff, uh, this is. I don't think this is professionally done. Look at that big glump of glue in there. Glump of glue. Uh, but that's a great uh, Grimes Fine dollar sale. Dollar bid, no reserve. We can lock that, sir. Look at this. So, we're digging this. Yeah, I debated whether to go buy some more units today, just so we'd have some cool individual items. Still, okay, looks like old shaving mirror, or one on top of a desk. That's a cool mirror. Look at that. Yeah. Let's see if we can fix this. Put a little wood glue on that. But that's got a cool, like shabby chic look to it. Uh, but now, I mean, there was probably a mirror in that, but. Pop a picture in there. That's kind of nice. I like that picture frame. That can go by itself. Let's see what we got. Is this all the stuff that was in that box? 
so far. Man, okay. Cheap, 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 cheap. Let's see. Man, they wrap this up good. Okay. So this says uh, Japan. So this is probably like occupied Japan. Um, it's pretty dingy. Uh, you can find this stuff in thrift stores all day long. So. Ah, see, so we were looking for McCoy. So here's the deal. I'm going to check that because I'm not sure how McCoy started, if they automatically started um, marking McCoy on the bottom. But this is nice. So it says, this is what I was looking for. So that might be older McCoy because this is a McCoy style. Uh, but this says McCoy USA. Okay, little planner it looks like. It's got a Q mark in there. So... Uh, let's see, there's a very tiny little shaker bite right there, but this is a nice McCoy piece. This is good. You know, these can go up into the hundreds of dollars. Let's set that over so they can get it. That's very nice. Nice, 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 nice. Look at you striking out a little. Yep. Hey, that's a cool little salt shaker. Oh, you got the match? Yeah. Okay, some more cheap stuff. A little Christmas village stuff. Uh, uh, it's got a little, what are those, pigs? They look like monkeys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, there's a something. Ah, look at this. Made in China, it's so pretty. Mm -hmm. Look at that little flute vase. Look at that. That's nice. Right? You'd, buy, you'd pay a dollar for that, wouldn't you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would. I so some. anyway, we're going to clean that beautiful thing up. There's some beautiful bean footage, guys. Let's put this over there. That's kind of cool, too. Huh? That's something like a little... I don't know. Cool. It might be like an ashtray, or I don't know. That's really cool, though. Look at the computer. computer. That looks beautiful. Uh, we set that over there on the counter. That's really... I, I like that. What is this? I'm not even going to try to... Hey, read that. What's that say? Cock is closed. <laughs> 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 that's why I didn't try it. So there it is for appetizers, salads, dessert. That's a cool dollar item, I think. That's just a cool little advertising piece. This can go on the shelf by itself. Thank you, sir. Uh, let's see, we got a lot of little knickknacks, but I'm liking what they're finding. I'm not liking what I'm finding. Okay, what else do we got in here? Don't be more patient, please. Over Christmas. All right, here we go. This is kind of cool. Uh, it's probably, I don't know. It looks like maybe it's like a touristy kind of item from. It says something about earthquakes. If tail is dry, fine. If tail is wet, rain. Oh, is it like a rain gauge? I don't know. Kind of neat. Oh, maybe this is some more of that fine Chinese. Uh, Glass. And, uh, that's Avon. That's still cool though. Oh yeah, look at that. Uh, more, what we got in here? Oh, these look Stocky like... Cups? No, these no. are uh, napkin, uh, napkin. For napkin. Napkin rings. But a lot of these older ones from the 1800s are sterling, so we'll check them. And they're not. These are wood. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? Salt. I don't know, a lot of this is probably salt and pepper shakers. Man, there's so many items in this thing. Come on, Come on get some more good pottery. Uh, Hey, you want to do your Jesus Christ bit from that guy, that guy, you know, the pop locker preacher guy? No, you today. don't want to do it? Not today. No? All right. Just trying to, all right, this is cool. Yeah, I wish this was green, like uranium glass. That would have been nice, but, you know, make a little uh, orange juice with that. This can be cleaned up and go by itself. All right, so let's set that over there. Easy, easy day. Not today, we're going to break my stuff today. Oh, look at these. Who found these? I did. It was mine. Are you lying? Not going to play five of them. So, look. Little Coke glass set. 
six of them. Uh, there's six of them, all right. So there's no chips, dang scratches, hopefully. Seven of them. Uh, that's good. Let's put that over there as well. those sideways. Uh, so we're finding some good luck. Let's yeah, see what we got. All right. Okay, it's old cowboy boot, but we're in Texas. This kind of stuff sells. Uh, there's no signature on the bottom, but it's still no chips, no dings. A uh, little boot planter. Somebody's going to pay a buck for that. Actually, probably pay like 10 for it. <coughs> Let's see what else we got. Oh, there's this. It's a massive. All right, candle bra. That's what I call them. Bookends still sell well. Uh, that's cool if you're an owl fan. It's probably like 60, maybe 70. Okay, put that on the shelf. Oh, just need to make sure. So we'll put this, in, it's still in the auction. Uh, I might try to repair that with a brown marker, and then, but we'll disclose in there that it's like that. Some of the stuff I just hate throwing away because they don't make stuff like it anymore. Oh, here we go. This is cool, ashtray. The Roundup, check that out. Letter Buck, that's cool. So a little, probably I don't know, a little change thing, ashtray, I don't know, that's, that's pretty cool right there. David, we set this on the, the shelf. What did you do that? That's really cool. Uh, set them aside, if we get a set, we'll put them together. Uh, if not, we'll put them on the shelf lot. So anyway, look, this is just knickknacks. No sign. Oh, is that, that's a pin cushion. Mm -hmm. ah, somebody will pay for that. That's cool. Yeah. Yeah, let's see what else we got here. A little, little horsey action. We're in Texas again. So horses sell. It's like occupied Japan. It looks kind of like uh, Roman style. I'll find some silver. Oh, that's broke. So, well. Alright, I'm about done with this box. We're going to tear into another one. Even though there's still going to be good stuff in this box. I sold it. A little salt and pepper shaker. A little shell. These are cute. Do you see these? Little salt and pepper shakers, Japan. Got the old cork in them. So these are a great dollar item. But some salt and pepper shakers uh, go for hundreds of dollars. Just depends on which ones they are and the maker and all that good stuff, like everything else. No? Nothing. Alright, let's move down. Alright, fragile. Let's see what we got in this fragile box. Let's see. Hold that down. Okay. Sunset Pottery, made in California. Uh, it's got a big old chip right there, but we're gonna check it. Uh, we'll check to see if we can make a set of this stuff. That's disappointing. So, womp womp. Uh, this was. Oh. All right, it feels heavy. Pyrex. Pyrex. Oh, whoa, something shattered in here. So. Right. I don't know if I'm liking this box. Do you like this box? No. I don't like this box. Something okay. broken. Home trends made in China, so this is kind of like everyday stuff. Let's see what else we got here. Y'all find anything else? Nope. You gonna do your first episode of Leo's Lockers? Right now? Oh, oh. We can do it. Alright. Hey, where's the knife at? Never mind. Uh, eh. Eh. Eh, eh, eh. Mm -hmm. Hey, Leo, you like... Here, let's send this to Jeremy at What the Hells. He likes food from Lockers. Look. Get some good stuff in here. 
All right, we'll box this up and ship that to him. Um, what else we got? What else we got? What else we got? Let's go here. I think that, that McCoy planner might be the best piece so far. Uh, this is, uh, well, the clearest word I can make out is China. So, anyway, uh, oh, this is a, this will be a good, interesting box. Okay, so let's see what we got in here. Let's uh, see what we got in here. Check out this stuff. Scarfs. Oh no, this is just fabric. I know. I think I have this year. Okay. Oh, cool. We talked about sewing patterns earlier. This looks like personal stuff. Uh, we'll go through this a little bit more careful. So this looks like sewing stuff, patterns, ma mail. What's that say? Vogue art, oh, textile prints. So this is a magazine. This looks random. So this will go on our scrap metal. Scrap metal. You look in here, this is just like a crafts bag. But look at this. <clears throat> That's what you keep rings in. Oh, let's see what we got in here. Definitely a stamp on it. These might be. Oh, those are fake. So, <clears throat> and you can tell if you rub them on your teeth, the grittiness on the teeth will tell you it's real. So we'll, we'll look through this because look, there's some jewelry pieces in here. Maybe they kept uh, all their little gold earring backs and stuff like that. Sometimes you find silver. <clears throat> That's gross. Why'd you keep that in yogurt? <clears throat> Alright, so we'll probably lock this all in one lot. Weird stuff. Anyway, alright, I'm done with that box. Let's come down here. What you got, Leo? Hey, you did it. Leo's lockers. Leo's lockers. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <clears throat> we'll do David's jump later. <laughs> Uh, David made his first YouTube video yesterday, but he couldn't get uh, two seconds into the video without saying a curse word, so. <laughs> and it was very deliberate. <laughs> things happen, man. Yeah, things, yeah, things happen. happen. All right. So look down here. <clears throat> this stuff actually sells, but we're trying to, they want to see something interesting. Look at this. Man, this is the most pencils I've ever seen in my life. It smells like old erasers. Oh, it's a pack. Oh. Uh -huh. oh, a 10 pack. Coloring book, ammo. Fun fact about here when he gets mad, he sounds like Hermit the Frog. <laughs> right? Fine. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> All right, so hey, we're going to get back to work. But uh, anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed that unboxing. We did find some good pottery, which I do like when we find different kinds of. Uh, I want to say genres, the different uh, different uh, markets of collectibles and stuff. Pottery, you know, we found gold, we found silver, we found comics, baseball cards. Uh, but anyway, that's just a, a part of the life. Is you got to be an expert. Um, you know, it's got to be a mini expert in like all different kind of fields. If not, you're just throwing money out the window. So anyway, it's very important to know what you got before you sell it. But anyway, we're gonna finish cleaning up here and uh, finish up the dollar grimes. Um, 
uh, online Grimes Finds auction. Everything starts with dollar, no reserve. Make sure to check it out. A lot of these items you saw will be in there. Make sure you subscribe, hit that bell. Go to my feature channels and like all their pages and subscribe. And don't forget the AA meetings on Wednesday nights. Next week's going to be on... Where's it next week? Can't remember. I'll let you know. It'll be in the link. Anyway, we'll see you.